What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So it freaking happened. The Last of Us 2 got delayed yet again. Find out why today. And if you like this content, if you like all my hard work I've been doing for you guys, be sure. Go over here, hit the subscribe button, become a part of the family, leave a like on the video, leave a comment down below. Enjoy the video. I guess I'm just going to start with a letter for you guys. I don't know, this is just such a tough time, you know what I mean? Such a weird thing to be going through. I'm not used to all these cancellations and all this kind of stuff, but like, you know, on one hand I can see how important it is for everybody to stay inside and not get other people sick, but on the other it just sucks. You know, it's such a freaking downer on all these events and all these awesome things that we look forward to every year. Man, I was really looking forward to this game. I don't know about you guys. I love The Last of Us 1, of course. It's got so many freaking fans out there. This trailer I got on here, I freaking am so psyched just seeing it. But then it's not even going to come out until probably later this year sometime, you know what I mean? Which I'm thinking maybe they're trying to push it back to the PS5 when that comes out. I think maybe, you know, they kind of had that planned. You know, maybe they're going to make it like a launch title or something. Who knows? We'll see. Alright, this is from Naughty Dog's Twitter, guys. As you've likely just seen, the release of The Last of Us Part 2 has been delayed. We're sure this news is just as disappointing to you as it is to us. We wanted to reach out to all of you in our community to give you a little more information. The good news is we're nearly done with development of The Last of Us Part 2. We are in the midst of fixing our final bugs. However, even with us finishing the game, we were faced with the reality that due to logistics beyond our control, we couldn't launch The Last of Us Part 2 to our satisfaction. We want to make sure everyone gets to play The Last of Us Part 2 around the same time, ensuring that we're doing everything possible to preserve the best experience for everyone. This meant delaying the game until such a time where we can solve these logistic issues. That kind of goes along with the same thing they were saying about Final Fantasy 7 Remake, even though this game's a lot further out than Final Fantasy 7, because that comes out next week. I'm so freaking excited for it. <laughs> Let me know down in the comments if you guys are too. But I don't know, I, I still think they're just trying to make this, you know, like a PS5 launch, you know, exclusive or something. I definitely would believe that a lot more than, I don't know. Because that's still a couple of months away. I mean, what was it, the end, of, the end of May it was supposed to come out? Let me know down in the comments what you guys think is going on here. Do you think it's actually because of the virus or you, you think they're just trying to buy time? I mean, it even says right there that they're just trying to fix bugs and stuff. So, I think it's good that they're, you know, holding it off. It's always good, you know. In the end, it'll be worth it. You know, you can't be mad. If there's bugs and stuff, why would you want them to release it right now? That just doesn't make sense. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, they can release it next month, but if it's got bugs and stuff, probably because they're still developing it, you know, mainly for the PS5, which I'm definitely thinking is going to, you know, it's it's what they're doing. <laughs> I don't know. Let me know in the comments. What do you guys think about this? It's, it's all confusing, and there's so many different things that it could be, and I don't know. What do you guys think? Continuing with the letter, though, it says... We were bummed about this decision, but ultimately understood it's what's best and fair to all of our players. We're hoping that this won't be a long delay, and we'll update you as soon as we have new information to share. We wish you all, your families, and your friends the best of health. Thank you for being amazing fans and your continued support. Stay safe, Naughty Dog. This is still one of my favorite series, though, and I was definitely looking forward to the second one, guys. So what I'm going to do, this trailer that I have playing right now, I'm just going to let it keep playing on to the end, however much is left with it. I'll just let it keep playing and let you guys see this trailer that I think it's from back in like 2017 or so, way back in the day. <laughs> wow, I can't believe it's already been like four years or three years or something since this came out. I was definitely expecting it a lot sooner, but you know, you know how games are sometimes. But in the end, it'll be worth it, guys. If it's anything... Like Final Fantasy 7, it's going to be worth it, guys. Definitely worth the wait. I'm so pumped for it. It still is not even, you know, it doesn't seem real that Final Fantasy 7 comes out next week. You know what I mean? I'm going to have it. I got a PS4 Pro. All the puzzle pieces are coming together. I don't know about you guys out there. I'm just trying to stay positive. Yeah, I know a lot of the people already freaking have the game, are spoiling it, doing all kinds of bad things, you know, but they're enjoying it. They've been waiting so long. But I just gotta, I gotta be positive, guys. You guys just gotta be positive. We're all gonna get through these times. You just have to trust, stay inside, enjoy playing games, guys. Try not to get other people sick, especially the older people and whatnot. Just, this is such a good time, guys. Take advantage of it. 
do some gaming. This channel is doing so good for only being a few months old. Every day, we grow bigger and bigger, get more views. I get better at doing these videos and whatnot and learning the stupid algorithm that is YouTube. <laughs> you know, it's just, I'm learning and uh, things are definitely getting a lot better. I've had a couple videos that got like a thousand views already within, you know, a day or so. So everything is getting better, guys. And I couldn't be anywhere without you guys. I wouldn't be nothing. So I appreciate every one of my subscribers. Of course, every single one of my videos from now on are going to be 4K 60 frames. Let me know how you guys like this quality in the comments. Leave a like on the video if you like this freaking video. Subscribe if you're not a subscriber. I hope everyone is staying healthy out there, staying inside, playing games, not leaving unless it's an emergency. I appreciate every one of you guys. I'll see you on the next one.